Hi y'all, my name is Sarah Moore. I'm a wife, a mom, a pediatrician, and a triathlete. I live in the Woodlands, Texas, and I would love for Ironman to follow me on my journey as I attempt to qualify for Kona at Ironman Texas on April 28th, 2018. Growing up, I was a competitive swimmer over the past two and a half years while training for Ironman. I've rediscovered the satisfaction of working hard and pushing my body to the limits to achieve a goal. I feel like I'm an ordinary person just like everyone else. I struggle with time commitments and balancing family, work, and training. I'm an example that anything is possible through hard work and dedication when you have a loving, supportive, and encouraging group of people backing you up. The one word I would use to describe my wife, Sarah, is driven. One word I would use to describe my mom is hardworking and supportive. Your mama. Um, my mom is kind, and when we run together on the turkey tart and Thanksgiving day, it was really fun. Hey kids, the one word I would use to describe Sarah is beast, the end. The word that I would use to describe Sarah is determined. Describe Sarah is determined. Is determined. We use to describe my friend Sarah is she's talented. Can't say more than that. Love your friend. Bye. The one word I would use to describe Dr. Moore is inspiring. A word that I would use to describe Sarah will be trustworthy. Definitely trustworthy. And super califragilistic espialidotos. A word that we would use to describe Sarah is caring. Describe Sarah is unwavering. Hi there. So a word to describe Sarah. Um, it's just hard to describe her with one word because this girl is just an amazing person. I mean, she's a doctor, she's a wife, she's a mom, she's an athlete. Um, but there is there is a word that I will use and to define Sarah, and I think a lot of people will agree with me, and is that. She's a humble person. Sarah is humble, regardless any race time um, or any improvement, anything. I mean, she's just she's just a humble person, a beautiful human being.